This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe, and let's get right into the news. All right, so we got Jennifer Aniston, an old tweet saying, P.S., it's not funny to vote for Kanye. I don't know how else to say it. Well, <laughs> I mean, this girl, this Jennifer Aniston is turning out to be a real moron because she just gets herself involved in too much stuff. I like Kanye's response, though. said, friends wasn't funny either. It really wasn't. But, uh, you know, her getting, her get, trying to get Jimmy Fox canceled recently for not understanding religion and what he was referring to, basically a deeper meaning of, you know, your friends will backstab you, watch your back. You know, that, that's what it was. It wasn't, he, she tried to make it, uh, you know, like anti-Semitic thing she, cause, cause she likes to be driving some type of narrative. She needs to, I don't know what's up with her. She's lost her mind i think brad pitt really finished her off that's that's what probably happened right there kim kardashian okay she's getting a lot of backlash from the victim in the c murder case now it's pretty obvious that c murder didn't do this but then these people should want the real person that killed their son to go to jail but uh george thomas says whenever a celebrity such as kim kardashian advocates for c murder uh, it's like reopening the same wound that cut this family so deep years ago. Uh, he is a happy. Uh, he is happy. Kim wants to fight for innocent, but C. Murder is not the man to be advocating for. Only time will tell if anything further happens to this tragic occurrence twenty years ago. There was another guy. Like the, there's so much evidence about that. Like if you really read this case, it's messy. Uh, Kim Kardashian. I'm sorry, yeah, uh, Beyonce. <laughs> Beyonce puts Lizzo back in the lyrics, so I guess she forgave Lizzo, even though Lizzo is being accused of crazy stuff by her dancers. You know, stuff with bananas and all kinds of stuff. It's pretty. Uh, we'll see, we'll see where that goes. I think it's a bunch of cloud chasers, to be honest. But. I do see that Lizzo isn't this nice, sweet girl you see on TV at the same time. But I do think uh, these people accusing her of everything, they thought she was this nice person, but she's really a shrewd businesswoman that will cut you off if you, uh, you know, go if you're not good for business at the moment. You know, she's not this happy-go-lucky person that everyone thinks she is, which there's nothing wrong with that. But, uh... You know, she has to stop playing the victim at the same time, too, because that's getting annoying. The Island Boys take it to another level. These are brothers. Now they photograph themselves in a position of giving each other oral. This is disgusting. Uh, Charleston White <laughs> commented, and I can't say what he said because it's vulgar. But these guys are just like, I mean, they'll go, they'll do anything for clout. These guys were making out with each other. They're brothers. This is disgusting. Elon Musk said uh, Zuck vs. Musk fight will uh, be streamed live on X. All proceeds will go to charity for veterans. That, that fight's never going to happen. Jury selection continues in uh, Young Thug case. Uh, this, this jury selection could go on for the rest of the year, they said. This is, I, I, I don't know what else I could say about this trial. It's, it's very messy. Mr. Beast is being taken to court by uh, his, let's see, the company behind his virtual burger that's done in ghost kitchens around the country. Um, nobody really cares, but they're saying he didn't fulfill his obligations. But really, he was mad because the consistency was off with each ghost kitchen. So, they fe he felt like they were damaging his brand. But they feel like now, oh, you're damaging our brand. So, this is going to be, uh, let's say, this case is about social media celebrity who believes his fame means that his word doesn't matter. That facts do not matter. And that he can... Uh, take, you know, go back on a contract. Let's see. He is mistaken. $100 million. I don't know. 
I think they were hoping that this burger would be bigger than it really is. He really went hard promoting it. I just don't think people would, like, you know, come on, man, another burger? It's like, okay. And nobody's going to pay that much for a burger because when it's done in a ghost kitchen, it has to be delivered. It's just. Some people will pay it, some people won't. Uh, let's see. Then we got Carly Red. She's crying of tears because she believes she has another hit record on her hands. Let's listen. Tears of joy because I have so many people be trying to hate on me. And, and, and like, I work so fucking hard. I work so hard. Number one on iTunes again. What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> I had a hit song. She never had what? Another hit song? Number one on iTunes doesn't mean you have a hit on your hands. It means that a bunch of people were buying it at one time or streaming it at one time because it just came out and you went number one. It doesn't mean you have a hit. A hit record is people can, people know your record. I didn't even know she really sang. I thought it was a joke on Love and Hip Hop. <laughs> to film yourself crying. <laughs> uh, that always that always gets me. Then we got uh, Tory Lanez expected to be sentenced today. They want 13 years. Uh, little TJ. Okay. That another time. This is George Tower with JT News.